Hello and welcome to Blockchain Gaming World with me, John Jordan. So, um, quick video today, just because we have had the launch of uh, the uh, Immutable X uh, marketplace. So, um, a bit of uh, explanation. So, Immutable is the company that we used to know as uh, Fuel Games, based in Australia. Um, they renamed themselves uh, Immutable. Um, I don't know, get well over a year now. Probably you know, a year and a half, maybe even two. Anyway, uh, they're the company behind uh, Gods Unchained, which was. Um, Back in sort of 2018, 2019, um, did a very big sale of cards. So, is, so Gods Unchained is, is a sort of Hearthstone type game, um, uh, and you can see the cards here. So that game's been sort of a undergoing kind of development and, and, and sort of a prolonged sort of a, a sort of a redesign actually um, for the last sort of year or so. Um, and one of the reasons it has been, I think, a slow, slower process than they would have liked is they've also been sort of building their own technology. So Immutable is the company and Immutable X is their, uh, is their own sort of blockchain. It, it's effectively a layer two solution that actually uses a technology called Starkware, uh, which uses uh, ZK rollups, uh, zero knowledge rollups. So that's a kind of a term that is being thrown around a lot when it comes to scalability on the Ethereum blockchain. It's basically just a sort of clever um, kind of cryptographic way of um, running a blockchain um, in, a, in a faster form than um, currently Ethereum uh, as a proof of work blockchain runs at. So we won't worry too much about the technicalities just to say this is, a, this is like a, a scaling solution, a layer two solution for Ethereum. Um, so this is, it. this is the alpha. So as you can see, there's, there's, very, there's sort of very little functionality other than the fact it works. So um, I have logged in. So when you, when you um, uh, you can just this is browser based. Um, you can just log in um, and you connect your MetaMask. So I've connected my MetaMask wallet to this, and also it links uh, cryptographically. It sort of links your uh, MetaMask wallet to your account. Because obviously your MetaMask wallet is running on the Ethereum blockchain, is connected to the Ethereum blockchain, and Immutable X is 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 a layer two solution. So effectively, it's a different blockchain. So so um, you know you're you're sort of uh, you're you're kind of um, using your your um, yeah, you're, you're linking your, your Ethereum wallet with, with this new blockchain, although it's compatible with Ethereum, if that makes sense. Um, yes, yeah, it's, it's in alpha, so there's very little sort of, um, of the functionality we would expect. So this is just kind of what you see. These are the items for sale. You can't really um, reorder them. You can't filter them by price. You can't filter them by anything. You could, you could, you could put in, there you go, monster. So let's go and search for some monsters. I don't, um, I'm by no means an expert in God's Unchained uh, cards. I have, I have played it, um, but now quite a long time ago. So I can't really remember that, but we can see here here's, uh, here's some monster cards, and we can see um, there's different um, uh, there's different sort of pricing for these ones. Um, so obviously there's sort of the, the typical sort of rarity value going on here. Going on here. And basically they've um, minted, um, they, they've kind of kind of ported over a whole bunch of the of the uh, uh, Gods Unchained cards onto this uh, Immutable X blockchain. So these are now um, you can be kind of bought and sold. Um, obviously, in order to do that, you do have to um, port over your um, port over some ETH. So, um, say I, mean, I haven't got any, um, I haven't got any funds. I'm not porting anything over yet. Yet, so, so this will cost me zero point zero one two five ETH. So this is still they're still using ETH, although it's sort of in a sense it's sort of a well, I suppose it is ETH, but it's kind of a, an ETH from a, on a running on a different blockchain. I suppose this is how ZK Rollup sort of handles it. So it is still ETH. Um, because you're sort of rolling up all the transactions, which is how you get the throughput. Um, but but you have to, even though I've got some ETH in my MetaMask wallet, I've got no balance in my Immutable X, uh, on the Immutable X blockchain. So this is like if you've ever used another layer two, like a uh, Matic or Polygon, um, you have to sort of um, transfer you know, transfer tokens over. So um, if I wanted to do that, I would have to transfer over. So you can see at the moment, this is my Ethereum wallet and I've got 0 0.016. Uh, so if I wanted to say, I wanted to swap a small amount of Ethereum over, I'd have to deposit that um, from my, uh, from the Ethereum blockchain onto this uh, Immutable X effectively blockchain. If I did that, I would have to sign that through um, MetaMask. Um, so I have to go, yeah, I wanna, I wanna do that. Um, and then obviously I would have to do the uh, sign it um, through MetaMask, and then obviously, if I if I want to do this, I have to pay the gas fee. So, you know, at this point, I'm doing 0 0.006 ETH, but it's going to cost me 0 0.0067. It's going to cost me fourteen dollars to do that. So, um, obviously, uh, I'm probably not going to do that. Um, if you are interested in in kind of buying these cards, um, then obviously, what you what you'd be wanting to do is putting in a larger amount. So, the gas fee, I guess, isn't so expensive. You can always do you can always experiment, I suppose. Um, 
and uh, and 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 do a small amount first if you if you're not bothered too much about the gas fees. Um, and but the point is once you once you get this the value over from Ethereum to the Immutable X blockchain, um, you can you can basically basically then you're not paying any gas fees or your gas fees are sort of uh, sort of marginal. Um, and you can buy those cards. So I guess at the moment, this is something that um, sort of only makes sense for people who are interested in, in picking up um, Gods Unchained cards. Obviously, at the moment, you wouldn't buy these sort of things on the Ethereum blockchain because it's just too, gas fees are too expensive. Uh, but if you wanted to kind of start um, buying up some of these, um, then that would make sense. So at the moment, obviously, this is, this is just the marketplace. Um, there's no news. Um, I've not seen how this is integrated into the Gods Unchained game. Um, I'm not sure. I mean, Gods Unchained is moving to this as well, <laughs> um, so I guess this is the first stage of that. Uh, but to play Gods Unchained, um, you have to download a PC client as well, so they have their own sort of sort of um, integration for that as well. So there's a lot of moving parts in this sort of platform. But the interesting thing is, in general, there are more uh, games coming to Immutable X. So there have been some other games that have been announced that that will be using Immutable X. Um, so so we are starting to see um, a bit of a ecosystem, or we will start to see a bit of an ecosystem developing over the next kind of coming. Uh, months uh, so at that point it obviously will make more sense to, to to kind of bring some value over from ethereum if you want to play some of these other games that are using this sidechain so there we go um, a first step it's always good to see kind of um, you know after you've been hearing something uh, for, for a few months to see actually <laughs> actually it happens and, and, and it look, looks like it works I'll do a bit more experimentation I guess over the coming um, weeks to see but uh, thanks for watching the video please subscribe to the channel and see you again soon